What's up, YouTube family? You know what I'm saying? I'm back with another video. Your boy, Biseko. Now, we're going to talk about uh, things that I can't go without. You know what I'm saying? At least it's six of them, if I'm not mistaken, or nine. You know, nine things I can't go without on my daily life. You know what I'm saying? Because I know everybody got different things that they love. You know what I'm saying? Or they can't go a day or two without having them. But... I'm going to start showing y'all my stuff. You know what I'm saying? First of all, we're going to start with time. I always got to keep a watch on me. This is Michael Kors watch. My girl, I got this this for me for my birthday. I believe it was 2019 or 2018. My birthday is on March 23rd. So she got this watch for me and it was customized. I don't know if y'all can read it. It was customized with uh, my initials and... Uh, yeah, my first name and my last name, my initials, and some words that says to the new beginning. I don't know if y'all can read it or not, but yeah, I always got to have a watch to keep time. You know what I'm saying? Because time, time is money. You know how they say. Number two, a cell phone. You know what I'm saying? This just for a day-to-day -day communications. You know what I'm saying? I don't talk to too many people besides my girlfriend and family, my parents and stuff like that. Sometimes I don't even talk to them either like that, you know what I'm saying? But I keep a cell phone. You know what I'm saying? It could be a business matter. It could be family matter. It could be friends checking up on friends, friends checking up on me. You know, just regular stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Number three, a hair sponge. You know what I'm saying? I always got to keep this sponge with me all the time, especially once I get a fresh cut. You know what I'm saying? I always got to have my sponge. Anybody that's, uh, that's, I believe a lot of dudes keep this with them most of the time. You know what I'm saying? Unless you just don't like having sponges, but I do got to have it hair sponge with me all the time. You know what I'm saying? Even, even if I don't get a haircut, just to keep my hair looking, you know what I'm saying? Looking at least okay. If I don't get a haircut. Number four, right? We're on number four right now. I got to have this right here. It's, it's called uh, Ikuza African Shea Butter. You know what I'm saying? I got to have the Shea Butter with me all the time. It's it's made, like it's straight from, it's straight from uh, Ghana, Africa. That's West Africa. You can find this to the beauty supplies. But I bought mine from CVS, I believe so. So this is what it looks like in the inside. I already used it a couple times. You know, I love I love uh, how it feels on my skin, and I just like how it smells. It just smells raw. You know what I'm saying? Nothing nothing artificial about this stuff. It's straight from the motherland. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Ghana. Shout out to West Africa. You know what I'm saying? I love this product so much. I started using it, I think, two months ago, and my girlfriend be using it too, and she loves it. It makes her skin soft, make everything soft on your body. Okay, another thing. You know what I'm saying? You always got to smell fresh, you know what I mean? A grown man smell. This right here will bring that grown man smell, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it, it, it will uh, attract the ladies to come and ask you, you know what I'm saying? You know how it go. I ain't got to talk too much. But this is my favorite right here, Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue. You know what I'm saying? I always got to keep this with me. For this size of a bottle, I remember buying this for $75 at Sephora. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know how much it costs to other different stores, but I always got to keep my Dolce & Gabbana light blue. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I'm put it on right now. Oh, yeah. Make sure you smell fresh, stay clean. You know what I'm saying? Especially when it's hot. You know, I live in Texas. Dallas, Texas, it gets hot during summertime, and it's crazy. So you, you always got to have this with you all the time. I got to have it with me all the time. You know what I'm saying? And I suggest... Fellas out there, if you want to try this one now, go try it. You will not get disappointed. Trust me. You know what I'm saying? If you got a girlfriend, if you got a wife, man, just go try it, spray it, and go home one day. She's going to ask you, and you're probably going to get in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Another thing is, of course, you know what I'm saying, another stuff that makes you smell fresh and stay clean all the time, especially when you sweat. You don't want to be musty, you know, smell like onions or whatever, but Old Spice right here, Volcano. This right here is the game changer. 
once you put this on, sometimes once I put this on, I don't gotta uh, put the Dolce & Gabbana, but I try to put this on and my cologne at the same time, just to stay fresh all the time and smell good, you know what I'm saying? Now, another thing, I keep my house clean, smelling fresh, you know what I'm saying? Like paradise. I got this my mahogany coconut candle right here. You know what I'm saying? It smells so good. Like as soon as I light these candles up, once I clean up my house, cause I do clean, I do clean my house most most of the time every Sundays. You know, and when I light these candles, man, anybody that walks in my house, they you go you gotta go crazy, and you you gonna ask me what's that smell? I guarantee you. But you can find this at uh uh bath and body works and stuff like that you can we can go to the to the mall or stuff like that you can find this one right here but this this one of my favorite candles right here my top i would say my top three i got other candles that i like but this right here this is my favorite this is my this is my number one right here my first favorite candle okay now we're gonna go to to the last one you know what i'm saying i gotta keep my hand can right here just you know i'm a beer drinker you know what I'm saying? And I'm a social drinker at the same time. So I got to have this right here in my refrigerator. Just in case I come home from a long day of doing whatever. It could be from a long day of work. Come home. You know what I'm saying? Feeling a little bit thirsty. I got to have me a little hand can. A cold one. I don't drink hot beer. You know what I'm saying? Hot beer tastes like pee. But I got to have this right here in my refrigerator. And with that being said, guys. These are my essential stuff that I use them on a daily basis, you know what I'm saying? And I can't go without this stuff. This stuff right here make my life great all the time, you know what I'm saying? Especially the mains one, but as far as the beer, it's just something that I do drink some time to time. But the rest of the stuff that I just showed you guys, I got to have those stuff in my life, you know what I'm saying? But don't forget to... You know what to do, subscribe to my channel. You know what I'm saying? Push the notification button right there, the little bell thing. Go click on that, comment, you know what I'm saying? Leave some love, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I'm gonna drop another video next time. Y'all stay blessed, man. Peace out.